guys, so this is another video uh, tutorial. This time is on how to connect the computer, the MacBook, to the BioLoid using just the Bluetooth module. So if you ever, if you had um, played with BioLoid and stuff like that before, you know that oh, it's really tedious. You have to connect the power, and you have to connect the USB to SCART S232 wires, and everything. And every time you Put in the code. You have to disconnect it, connect it, and you know, you know, that can be really tedious. So now that you have the Bluetooth modules, everything can be wireless. So I already got the BT 100A uh, module connected to the COM port. So I'm just connected. I'll turn it on. Okay, there's some programs. Okay, let's wait a bit. Okay, hang on. Okay, so let, let's stand there for a bit. Okay, now I, I'm actually got Mac in front of me, but uh, I've got uh, Windows 7 installed inside. So not what you normally do, let me zoom into the computer. Let's see. Select USB, and then uh, connect Apple Bluetooth module. So I've already done that. So I'm gonna disconnect it and then reconnect it, just, just to prove that it works. So if you've got a PC, you can skip this step. So USB, connect Bluetooth host. So there you go. Boom, I see something down here. So bottom here, so this Bluetooth device. I click on that and I'll say select show Bluetooth devices. Okay. Alright, so I already found this Bluetooth device. I already paired it. The first time you might just want to put four zeros like I did before. And uh, okay, so it's already paired. So so it's cool. I can turn it off. Uh, now what you do is you just turn on anything, Robo Plus Motion. Alright. And it will actually assign a port to the US the, the Bluetooth so I think um, 6 connect you can see some light flashing beeps data transmit so it's going to transmit the motion file from the bio load into the computer and okay so here you go the files there so what we can do now is just play around. Um, so let me create a frame, two frames. Uh, I'll capture this frame here. I press hold and get the motion into here. Okay. And then I'll change this frame. So I'm gonna, I'm gonna uh, release the torque. Like that. Freeze it again. Assign it to the first frame. So here we go. I already done a program. Very easy. Just go. And now it's going to run it. So see, all this can be done wirelessly without the hassles of uh, connecting the wire and stuff. So here you get. Here you goes. Um, here's the Bluetooth modules. Can connect to the internal uh, Bluetooth modules in the Mac. <laughs> And, uh, and yeah, so it's working. So thanks for watching, guys. Hope you guys have a good Easter. Thank you. Bye-bye.